are driving the world's first computer-guided tour vehicle. Go right. This will be one of the most unique city tours you've ever taken. You'll see why Time Magazine named me one of the coolest inventions of the year. ...as entertainment for hotel guests. It was intended to resemble an artist community in an old Spanish village. With weathered stucco facades, wrought iron balconies, red tiled roofs, rickety wooden shutters, gas lights, and even courtyards with wishing wells to complete the effect. This ocean to Biscayne Bay. There are about 400 businesses within this commercial area, sidewalk cafes, restaurants, art galleries, and all kinds of street entertainment including Howard Hughes, Elizabeth Taylor, Julio Iglesias, Don Johnson, and Ella Bridge. With Fisher's money, Collins finally finished his bridge, which became the longest wooden bridge in the world. There's more to the Collins and Fisher story, but we'll hear In the 1930s, they were marketed as a South Sea Island. Since everything this city is all about. With palm trees, beaches, beautiful people, restaurants, hotels, stores and bars. It's all here. What a great backdrop for this tropical paradise. We're going to get a lot of attention around here. Toot the horn and say, hey, look at me. Don't I look cool in my go car? Keep going straight. Entertain his celebrity friends and supermodels. That era came to an end in 1997 when Mr. Versace would swim, eat, and watch girls in their bathing suits. Men wore a one-piece bathing suit that covered the chest. Men On our left is Shula's Steakhouse, owned by famous Miami Dolphins coach Don Shula. It's home to a famous 48-ounce porterhouse steak. 